as a formerly funny person. Like it or not, death may be a fact of life. We're all bound to shuffle off this mortal coil at some point or another, so it is best to be prepared for that inevitability any way we will. For some people, creating the right epitaph for his or her headstone may be a chance to precise what proportion they'll be missed by their loving family and friends, except for others it's a chance to get one last joke in, check out this collection of funny tombstones that may get laughs for all of eternity. Number 1. You're reading that right. One of these grave markers contains that age-old funny tombstone saying, I told you I was sick. But this husband and wife duo took the expression a step further with her retort, and I was sick of hearing it. Number 2. Short, concise, and to the point. You can't really argue with a sentiment like this. Number 3. Merv Griffin never lost his sense of humor. Venerable game show host Merv Griffin could not resist going out with a laugh. I will not be back after this message, his tombstone quips truthfully. Number 4. Neither did Rodney Dangerfield. Not to be outdone, legendary comedian Rodney Dangerfield left the world with the wry observation, there goes the neighborhood. Number 5. Simply not bothered. Oh well whatever. Lola lived to the ripe old age of 81, and by the time she was ready to fill out the form for her headstone, it seems that she was all out of insightful remarks. Number 6. I was hoping for a pyramid. This guy had some big goals. Too bad he'll have to settle for this small granite headstone instead of a glitzy tomb. Maybe in your next life. Number 7. That's all folks. Mel Blanc created characters like Bugs Bunny, Elmer Fudd, Daffy Duck, and yes, Porky Pig. He really was the man of 1,000 voices, and it makes sense that he would go out quoting one of his best-loved character's closing sentiments. Number 8. What's so funny? We're sure these are just the deceased's initials, but it sure does make it look like he died laughing. Number 9. Another round of giggles. Life's too short to be serious all the time, and apparently that goes for death, too. Number 10. Schwing. Wayne and Garth from, Wayne's World, would be so proud.